How's it going guys? Sharblox here. Welcome back to another Roblox video here on the channel. Now for today's video guys, I really did not expect to be making this video. I know I say that a lot, but today's video is about Roblox Limiteds. And basically what's happened guys is a random Roblox accessory has gone limited. And this is like the first time in like two or three years. And that's Roblox have set an item to limited, which isn't actually a sponsored item. I'm sure you guys know what I mean by sponsored items like Gucci or the North Face or NFL. And there's been loads of those recently. But yeah, check out this tweet from Roblox Trading News. They said, for the first time in 2.5 years, a non-sponsored Roblox item has gone limited. The item Sinister S was made limited by Roblox. This was most likely a mistake. And here is the item link. And oh my gosh, this thing is selling for 125k. Okay, at the time of recording this video now, it's selling for 100k. But yeah, that's insane. I never expected this to happen. And I do kind of agree with Roblox trading news. Yeah, this might actually be a mistake because why would Roblox make this item go limited? Like it doesn't really make much sense. We all thought Roblox didn't really do that anymore. I mean, yeah, look at this for an example. All of the recent stuff, unless it was updated for like offensive reasons or something. But apart from that, all of like the actual new limiteds are sponsored items from companies like NFL, Gucci, McLaren Racing, Vans, The North Face, Zara Larson. Yeah, all of this kind of stuff. So before the Sinister S, which went limited today, the last non-branded or non-sponsored Roblox items to go limited was this set of stuff back in October and November of 2019. Of course, we had the Dominus for Mijolosis, the Halloween Dominus, the Green Domino Crown, some Federation crowns as well, and the Ice Falc. We can't forget about that one. But yeah, guys, it's been such a long time. 2.5 years, nearly three years. That's insane. The other unusual thing about the Sinister S going limited is Roblox did actually cancel the Sinister series like two years years ago. Yeah, if you guys didn't know, the Sinister F was the final one, and that was on sale for 800 Robux. Roblox never even bothered to take this item off sale, which pretty much meant they ended the Sinister series. They never made a new one since, like, 2019. But yeah, honestly, that's pretty mad. I really do enjoy the Sinister series as well. These Halloween pumpkins were so sick. I think one of them was free, like the Sinister P back in, like, 2007 or 2008. Yeah, it was a very long time ago. I know a few of you guys are probably going to ask me this, so I'm just going to add it into the video. I bet some of you are wondering, is Sinister F going to go limited? Now, to be honest, guys, I highly doubt it. I'm pretty sure this was a mistake from Roblox, but to be fair, if you want Sinister F, it's honestly a pretty cool accessory for 800 Robux, and it's the last of the Sinister Pumpkins. Wait, I just realized Sinister F, pay your respects to the Pumpkin of the Year. Was that like an indication that it was the last Sinister ever? I mean, possibly. I only just noticed that. But yeah, like I was saying, if you want Sinister F. It's pretty cool. It's still on sale. But yeah, to be honest, guys, I don't think this is going limited. I'm kind of hoping now, guys, that some of these forgotten accessories also go limited, just like Sinister S did. I mean, look at this, Shriek. Imagine if that went limited as well. That'd be so sick. There's literally like thousands of forgotten accessories. Roblox could honestly make some of these limited as well. That would be so cool. Yeah, if anyone from Roblox is watching this video, please make the work clock headphones go limited. I bought this for 3k like three years ago or something. I really want this item them to go limited. That'd be so cool. I'd probably keep it though, or I might give it to one of you guys. I don't know. But yeah, there we have it guys. Sinister S. Updated and made limited seven hours ago. It's a very rare Roblox accessory from Halloween of 2010 that randomly went limited today. I know it doesn't make much sense whatsoever. Is Roblox actually bringing back making random accessories limited? I really hope so, but I also kind of doubt it. Maybe Roblox is finally listening to the community. I mean, that would be nice for a change, wouldn't it? And look, guys, one of them was sold for like 75k. And that is so sick. I'm so surprised Robux did this. Whether it was a mistake or not, it's too late now. They can't reverse anything. Once an item is made limited, that's it. They can't go back on that. I really did not expect to be making this video tonight. But yeah, there you go. That's really cool news. So if you guys enjoyed this video, found it interesting, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Let me know what you think about this, guys, down below in the comment section. Is Roblox finally bringing back regular limited items? Like, like non-branded or non-sponsored stuff. If more random and classic Roblox accessories go limited, that's going to be sick. Now, if you guys wanted to know the reason why Roblox don't make random accessories go limited anymore, I think it's because Roblox as a company don't really gain anything from it. In fact, they might even lose money by making random stuff go limited. I know you cannot devx Robux earned via selling limiteds, but if you think about it, guys, just like with the Sinister S for an example, someone purchased that for like 
like 250 Robux back in 2010 and now they are selling it for like 100k. Yeah, that's an insane profit. Of course, if those guys sell their Sinister S, they are not going to need to spend real money on Robux for a very long time. Also, I guess a lot of the Roblox black market sites still sell limiteds for real money. Yeah, it's pretty dodgy, but some people do buy limiteds via PayPal and Bitcoin. I definitely wouldn't advise doing that though. It's really easy to get your account banned by doing that kind of stuff. But yeah, that's mostly why Roblox don't do original items as limiteds anymore. With the sponsored stuff, Roblox get money to make them limited anyway. Hopefully I explained that well. And yeah, I guess that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you guys in the next one.